The FRS team were led to the vice president's office by its core Mashar Sheo Mohammed. Speaking during the meeting, the vice president stressed the urgent need to address the increasing road accidents on the highways and in the cities caused by non-adherence to traffic regulations. According to Vice President Shetima, his directive is aimed at addressing Nigerian's road safety challenges and drastically reducing road traffic accidents across the country. The Vice President is set to inaugurate the National Road Safety Advisory Council saddled with the responsibility of reducing traffic accidents by half before 2030. The Vice President, who chairs the National Road Safety Advisory Council, highlighted the importance of leveraging technology and enforcing discipline to improve road safety. Senator Shatima emphasized the interconnected nature of road safety with broader security concerns across the country. Earlier, the FRSC core Mashav Shehu Mohammed says the National Road Safety Advisory Council is a critical aspect of the updated Nigerian road safety strategy. The idea, according to him, is to reduce road traffic crashes by 50% between now and 2030. He outlined the council's primary functions to include setting national road safety targets, coordinating efforts between federal, states, and local governments, and overseeing the implementation of strategic initiatives. The council membership include six governors representing the six geopolitical zone, various federal ministers, the national security advisor, and the president of the National Association of Local Governments in Nigeria, Algon. From the Asarok Presidential Villa, Amikaro Atta, ITV News.